All right, y'all. Welcome. Welcome back to Kamish Reviews. Am I on the screen? I think I am on the screen. So before I bring up the latest, you guys, this is a new um, new season. Okay. We review panel. Going to talk about this. But also today is, of course, um, it is 420. So have a 420 to everybody that is out there that is going to be, you know, getting their smoke on and all the things. Make sure you guys are eating. That's all I'm saying. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure that it's a good one. It's a good one. But so far, let me go ahead and bring up something. My queen, which would be Miss Petty Mike. Ebby is in the building. We got Receipt Queen in the building. And we always have people who are late. That's pretty much part of the panel at this point. Um, <laughs> it literally is. What's going on, Dina and uh, Ebby? How y'all doing, Mama? It's happy 420 and all the things. How y'all doing? Not wishing happy 420 to somebody who's never smoked a day in their life. Hey, well, it's, it's a day, it's a special day. Yeah. Come on, receipt. Uh, take, uh, take your word for it. Take your word for it. Yeah, I, 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 I can tell you that and all the things about it. But uh, anyway, <laughs> Dina, you here, mama? I am here. Oh, okay, okay. I like the uh, receipts. So, can you give us a recap on this new series that we're about to talk about? Well, I didn't really take much notes, but I'm going to go figure it out. Okay, okay. so uh, first the ladies come, and it's seven ladies, and it's too many names for me to remember. I'm going to mm -hmm. channel my inner Ebby today. So um, so basically the ladies come in, they start to tell their stories about how long they've been with whoever or whatever. Um, then the men, um, oh, then Taronda comes and she tells the ladies that the men have been, uh, planning a special date for them and to go get ready. Then each one of the men pick a special date for the ladies to go on. And then they're kind of given their narrative of the first impressions. Each, each person's given their narrative, like in the confessional about the first impressions and yada, yada, whatever. And then towards the end, after everybody had their date, they all go back to the house. So then the ladies have already met. The men meet the other men. And then the ladies and the men, you can see how everybody interacts um, as a group. And then there was a little drama. Uh -oh, I, forget the, I, forget the, uh, I forget the girl's name, but the dude with all the tattoos and the gold teeth that look like, you know, he's giving a uh, woman beater vibes. But anyways... Um, and then they have their little bit of drama, and then they kind of show what's gonna happen throughout the, the rest of the season. And I am just I don't know, I'm my I am mind boggled about the craziness, especially the couple that has been in a relationship for 12 years. Like I can understand if you was off and on or y'all was just flirting and we could do like damn near catfish to see if this person is a real person and then the couple i forget their names but i remember this the couple that live in los angeles and i could have swore one said five years and then he said three years so i don't really know but anyway he insecure or something for whatever reason but i don't know how you live in the same city for three to five years and never seen this person in real life like oh, what have mercy. the entire mm -hmm. f and i mean here's the thing we got mega bus Greyhound, Spirit, Front Teeth on it here. You know what I'm saying? I'm not understanding. Now, granted, I understand kids and this is that. So the ones that are in like the nine month to 10 month stage, y'all know I've had my own experiences with, with anyways. Um, but yeah, so those I can kind of get because you know, my maybe my taxes ain't hit yet. You know what I'm saying? I'm paying child support, whatever the case is. But the three to five years in the same city and the 12 years I was on the flow. It was a lot. It was, it was a lot. Like I, I really had to watch it again to get the notes. Cause like, you know, everybody had a lot, not a lot, but different things going on. The for one you like you were speaking, first I want to say shout out to everybody that's on the panel. Uh, we just welcome uh, Erica and Nisi's up here. Lee. Welcome ladies. Thank you for the uh, really good recap. Uh, Dina, aka Christina. So, one of the things I wanted to, well, I'll start out with with Josh and Shay because I have the names. I can't remember the names myself. Um, they were really happy 
they well, I, I, put, I had to write them down. I was about to watch it again. Um, they were very happy, I felt like, to see each other after 12 years. And it seemed like he was speaking about his he had um childhood trauma and really wants to find love. They had the fun day at the amusement park. And uh, he said his part of his problem was he had a 13-year-old son and a three-year-old daughter, and he did not want to be far away from his children. She stays in Miami, and he stays in Tennessee. Um, out of everybody, I felt like the chemistry between them was stronger, probably because it had been freaking over, over a decade. But I still oh. try to figure out how they're going to build from where they are, because just as he was sitting there with her on the thing, he was like, I can't be a part of my kids. And she was like, well, what are we going to do? I live all the way in Miami. So... I want to start with them. Um, Ebby, what is your opinion about 12 years? What would you guys say? Let's start with Jay. I mean, some Marche. <clears throat> okay, so. Not the mic. I know you're getting ready to say what I'm thinking. Go ahead. Uh, blessed God. Yes. No damn way. Um, 12 years, and at no time, neither one of you have had any money. <laughs> Or been on vacation to where you could get to where the other one was for y'all to meet in person. It took coming on to a TV show for you guys to meet in person after 12 years. So you mean to tell me at no time did you have the whole, the, 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 let me see, let me, let me, let me. See, I'm gonna see what it is, what the amount is. Take your time, take your time, preacher. Mega bus from where she at? She in Miami to Tennessee. Hold on, you just hold your, just hold your line. Let's 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 get on the mega bus. Shall we? She on the mega bus website. Oh, we're gonna get on the mega bus because clearly, oh lord, you don't have plane ticket money. Frontier, you, you don't have, you I, don't, you don't. I you took don't a flight it. from, hold on, wait a minute. I took a flight from DC to Miami on Frontier for $39. What, what are we, the mega bus is, okay, let me hold just. Hold on, hold on, because, because, because clearly, you know, options. Okay. UK. Shout out to, shout, shout out to the, uh, never ever, uh, never ever met, uh, Kaz in the Instagram chat. Oh my That's God. <sighs> Hey, you can't even get the mega bus from Miami to Tennessee. Well, we'll check Frontier. Or, or we'll check Frontier? Sure. Not a problem. I will absolutely do that. Frontier okay, Airlines well, coming up. Well, just, listen, while, we just wanna... while we have Auntie Travel Agent searching the Look, interwebs period. for the for the flight information, I the 12 years relationship, I don't. There's no, I don't understand it, and this is why. Because he got a 13-year-old and a 3-year-old, but he was in a relationship for 12 years. So did y'all take a break in order to have the 3-year-old? Because... I, I, mm -hmm. I don't this know. This show is ghetto. That's all I got for it. I, I tried. I... This this is what this why this is a perfect day for it to be on to be on the 420 is all I'm saying. It's like the perfect I, day. Like we got we gotta get I like, tried. I, I tried to understand that the, the uh, listen, please, if thou, if if you were the couple that's 12 years that's in the Instagram chat, please don't slide into my DMs and cuss me out. I I'm just trying to understand um 12 years and y'all have only been on cyberweb for 12 years. I yeah. Erica, Miss, Miss Erica, what, what you what you call Erica? You call her name Leah, so cute. Uh, Erica, what you gotta say? Uh, e breezy. Oh, oh my gosh, I love you. <laughs> Thank what you. you. Got? Can uh -oh. you guys hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Go e ahead, Mama. Okay, sorry, I'm driving. Um, so yeah, so one, I was gonna say the kid thing. Like, was the three year old during the twelve years, or is the three year old now eighteen, and the twelve year old is twenty four? Like, I'm confused by <laughs> the time. No, and then I don't know. Something. So, and I don't think, um, yeah, like I, I don't know. I would say obviously it's not a money issue. So I do feel like the twelve year, the five years, like that's the question of the show. So either someone was in prison, someone was in a relationship. There's something else. Walker. 
<laughs> Thank you. There's something else going on. Mm-hmm. Why, you know what I'm saying? Why they couldn't coordinate or they didn't want to, or, you know, like, so that is sort of, I assume, the intrigue of the episodes. Um, so I feel like it's yeah, a yeah, lot yeah, going yeah. on with the show because the other people, like, you just met this dude on Tinder three months ago. Why are you even on the show? Like, mm-hmm. y'all, y'all could text a few more months. But if you want to be here, you know what I mean? It's like, of course, y'all not in a relationship because you just met her on Instagram the other day. So, like, what are you talking about? Oh so, um, so I think, I think it's a lot. And then to put everybody in the same house does add amazing. another a, another dimension to put a whole bunch of people who basically don't know each other in other right. house to have other options. Very good. Okay, very good. that's yes. what we're doing. So I feel like <laughs> it does give the feel like let's throw everything on the wall and see what sticks, and I guess we'll see. Okay, it's so cool. I like I like. Look, hold on. First of all, I like how you said this. Let's throw stuff up on the wall and let it stick. It's, it's kind of how the program has been rolling out. Anyway, so pretty goody goodies in the building. What is going on, Mama? What is going on? We are. I am right now we're talking about the. We're talking about the 12 years. I want to break down the first dates because it's something I want to say, Lord Jesus. But I want to talk about each couple because we're, we're still learning names. And Listen, stuff like that. the man, the do you man have who could, people? The man oh, who could not open the bottle of wine. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I would never hold be able to we, 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 We're not going to jump there. Hold on, before we go there. Uh, but yes. I thought we was going but, on the dates. I said, Mama, <laughs> I said, we I said, we talking about the couples first. It was starting with the 12 years. And Goody just came in. I was getting ready to say, ma'am. Uh, Goody, go ahead. Uh, you just came in and you're late. We're talking about the 12 year and the couple. We kind of all gave our opinion about it. So, what do you got to say about it? Then we're gonna move on. I am but. glad that the 12 year couple is the only couple that I thought was gonna be a bunch of people on the foolishness where they hadn't seen each other because I was gonna be like, This is fraud, this is fraudulent. Even the 12 years seem a little odd, but um, yeah, I, I, I. Right now, the 12 years, I like them better than everybody else. That's the thing. See, 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 it's funny you say that because I have my I have my thoughts on that too about like the chemistry and stuff like that. It's a lot was going on. I think Erica kind of coned it really well when she said that she feels like it's more like maybe they have some insecurities, maybe they didn't want to see other things going on. Um, I, mean, I really think that's right. We can what I'm see. saying because I'm saying because the fact they didn't see them for 12 years is what I'm saying. It's, it's crazy that they didn't see each other. So just I mean, he's short. You could tell she sucked oh. her. Oh no. Um. I mean, <laughs> pause, pause, <laughs> pause. Uh, okay. Uh, you already coming in with the with, with the with the pow 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 because it's been a minute. But I want to go ahead and go to uh jo- Joanna, I think, and she said Joanna or call her Jody. And uh, they've been together nine months, and there's two Aaron's. So we got Aaron J. They met on IG. I ain't gonna lie, my notes I put no chemistry, no shade. That's oh. how I feel about them. Uh, it just it, it just was a, it's kind of a wreck. This is the one that uh, what, what Lee was going to jump was going to talk about well, is the one with the bottle. Know how to open the yeah yeah yeah. I, I feel I, and and I, I put my notes. I put in my notes no chemistry. That girl don't like him for real. That girl just <laughs> not. That she didn't like him. She didn't like him. Every time she said something, she didn't. She said she didn't like the man's pose or anything. But they <laughs> have been doing this for nine months. Right. I don't she think said she the date him. was I, for I her. Why they like even was not something that they could do together. She don't like him. She don't like him. She don't like him. She she don't like him at all. At all. That man. That man said he learned how to dance at eight years old. And try to remember. He did. He did salsa at eight years old and wanted to translate that at twenty four. And yeah, I'm like, what are we doing here? What's the flex with that, sir? That was so it, was flex, it was him trying to connect with her on the fact that he knows that she likes to dance. So he was she like, okay, she's let's pull this out my pocket. I could kind of do this. This would be cute for us to do. If she wouldn't well, go he like, took him salsa like him. So salsa I dance did. classes last week, not at eight years old. If that if you really don't want to impress her, you should have went last week. He was trying to find a way to connect with oh. her once they met each other in person. If and so he was like, hey, we'll try to do this, which was fine. It's whatever. It didn't even matter. It really she didn't TV. like him. If he didn't borrow Michael Jordan's earrings, she would have liked him. I knew when she hit that. Wait, wait, 
And she looked at him and rolled her eyes. Like, oh, this ain't going to work out. It don't matter what he did. He could have planned the perfect date and she would have found a problem with it. Because that's how she comes across. Because it don't matter what that boy did. Really? Tried to tell a joke. Wait a minute. They had wine really? there for her yeah. and a charcuterie board to try and cater to her um, and her likes and some whatever. Ignoring the fact that he don't necessarily drink, so he don't know nothing about it. He was like, well, I know these are things that she likes and I want to impress her and I want to do something nice for her and cater to her. Did she appreciate anything that this nigga did? Oh, No, not no. just like it. She didn't appreciate it, but when I'm okay, so hell look, I ain't gonna lie, it did come off, and I don't know if it was if the, the way they filmed it, it did come off. She had a little stank stank attitude that's going on. I will agree. But what I will say is I didn't understand that one side of date where you're getting everything that she likes only instead of getting something that maybe I both could like, but it wasn't like a bad, bad thing. But I'm saying she but responded we don't know. is fighting. negative. Very oh, hold on, hold on. I'm saying she responded to me very negative and everything she said. When she walked up, as soon as she walked up and she said, he's standing like it's a romance novel. I was like, oh my God, I said, it's a wrap. She needs to, it just needs to be over with. Over. She didn't like how she he looked. And I don't think she wants to admit she didn't like how he looked in person. I don't know what y'all think about it. That's what I thought. I thought maybe she didn't like how yeah, he looked in person. Was like just didn't want to say it. it was a man walk was up. standing there. Hold on, y'all. One at a time. Hold on, y'all. She didn't even, she was like, you don't even like the way the man stands. As he waits for you to come up to the Okay, so I'm oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna ask somebody, I'm gonna ask somebody a question that I know will Lee. I know she would say something, you know, she how she felt if she was didn't like or whatever, but I really want to know, especially because you brought up the part about the champagne. What would you would have said if you looked at you if you had to say, Do you not know how to open a champagne? I just want to know what she would say. This date is over. Oh my god. Yeah. Listen, listen, listen. Y'all know, that, oh, y'all know that wine is is in my food group. Okay, that's mm-hmm. like you don't know how to open Your a DNA. bottle. Of, you don't know how to open a bottle of wine. Get the fuck out of here. Mm-hmm. Well, you don't drink. Well, you don't drink. Why would you know how to? That doesn't make. Because if First I don't eat eggs, eggs, but I know how to make an omelet. Oh, oh, I'm allergic to oh, eggs. No my potato salad, my deviled eggs, my omelets, my scrambled eggs with cheese. All that should be fire. I don't yeah, eat do shit, you? though. It, you cook today? Well, how do you know it's fire if you will never eat it? Because everybody tells me that it's fire. And they be scraping <laughs> the bottom of the pan of the potato salad. <laughs> I'm so dead right my now. My kids like, are my yeah, official taste testers. I, do, I don't think yeah. so. I don't think kids might be lying. Everywhere. <laughs> no, Unless man, you are no. actively no. participating no, I was just playing. in drinking the wine. It, I, it's not like I drink all... I, I don't. I rarely drink. I do drink mm-hmm. sometimes when it's okay. over. However, the first time I came into contact with a wine bottle that had a cork in it, I had no idea what to do. I had to figure it out. Everybody right. has to figure it out when they come in contact with it for the first time. So you know what the thing is, you got an attitude because this is Abby says she's team Aaron right now. First time being with a wine bottle, so for you to have an attitude, you should have practiced a little bit. Okay, so, okay, it. all right, hold on. So this is my thing. Yep, you're 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 right. But here's no because if you <laughs> if you put a date together based upon all the things that she likes and you get a bottle of wine that you can't open, you should have just got a fucking uh, screw top. Everybody know how to do that. He because you're on a date. Yeah. If he don't you know, on a date, well, did, if you did well, you okay. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say I think everybody. I think all you guys are correct. But what I'm saying is, if you are going to plan a date. If you don't have knowledge of some things, don't make a you date do. more difficult. Don't make a date more difficult or more awkward. Do things that you know how to do. I don't care if it's simple stuff. Don't add stuff in that you know you're not familiar with. Why? You're not a drinker. Yeah, I'm saying, but what I'm saying is you're not a drink. You're not a hold on. You're not a drinker, but you even if you want to still cater to her. I mean, I don't know if there's a pop off top of wine. No, it's not. But I'm saying he still should have did something differently. You don't drink. You're not familiar no. with open a wine bottle. So you shouldn't even add it. It shouldn't even be a part of the date. It should be something sure, else sure. going on. That's, that's all I'm no. saying. That's all I'm what saying. What he should have done was say, well, you know, I don't drink and, and I've never opened it. Would you mind? I like that. I like that as well, Abby. I like that also. Yes. 
Yes. Or oh, he I like that too. That's a, that's, she may she may have had an attitude. No, she, she, she may have had an attitude. You know what I'm saying? As a man, that if you don't know how to do something, you still know how to get the job done effectively. Mm. Get the job you know done. You if you don't know how to do the water, you know I do. You you're you're the nasty ass. ass. <laughs> it's the like I don't understand. Like I appreciate that because I think I would hope if I'm going to be your help meet your helpmate, your revealer, that you, if you don't know how to do it, do you turn to me and you know I don't know how to do it, you let me do it. Are they in three months? They're the ones that were like three months, right? Nine. That's the, no, no. Uh, uh, not I, nine months, nine months, nine months, nine months. months. So he nine didn't months, nine months. He, he forgot the part of the interview or the date where you're supposed to see if the person's as into you. Oh, yeah. We forgot about the ID part, too, y'all. Y'all remember that person seen each other oh, before, Lord. and he mentioned that, and he said he lost his ID. So she, to me, I'm going to keep it 100%. I feel like she was done with him <laughs> then no, because she was still salty about that. She made a point saying that. She said, who don't have two IDs? Now, I'm going to say this. Not everybody have two IDs. Like, I mean, I have a driver's license, so that's not a new for me in Texas who have two IDs. So when she made that statement, I'm like, okay, everybody's not going to have two identification. They have a, um, their ID or driver license. Somebody's won't let you have two. You got to choose one, the Social Security or whatever. So her statement with that, I didn't get. I'm just saying, the state, I didn't understand the statement she made. She uh, I think what I she was ahead. trying to say is if you have an ID, you have a license and a passport. That's You know how people be tripping, like, do you have your passport? That's your second ID. Okay, I well, okay. um, that's what she meant. As somebody that's, who that's has lost their ID in the airport, I, airport. I just lost ID. mine. Let me not even lie before the party. I just got it in the mail yesterday. Let me know. I'm, I, I have listen, a, listen. I just got mine. What you mean? I'm listen, just, okay. As somebody my home girl ID. lost her ID <laughs> trying to go get her passport <laughs> and went and got another ID, came home and found it in the trash. <laughs> 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 She was mad. She was going to get her passport. Talk about too much happening at one time. Oh, my God. Too much happening at one time. And Jesus then she Christ. went home. I said, girl, check your pants. And she said, I, she had went to the pharmacy, and they put her ID in a bag, and she threw her ba the bag in the trash. So I'm just saying, things do happen. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't down do. the brother on losing his ID. Me either. I'm just saying that Me most either. Like people, I said, I just lost mine. You trying know to I travel did. and stuff, have an ID and a passport. Yeah, right. I'm not. So I'm, do happen. Like I say, I have lost the ID in a long time. 47, 47 years old, I lost my ID and I just got it back. I was too mad about that. So that does continuous ID loser. That's happened. Right so I don't here. know. I just I, I felt like at that moment yeah, she was done with him then, but <laughs> I had lost. She, she she was like she was like, well, the show for the come on. So let me go. Let me go. Let me go and continue the process. Look, 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 listen, listen, y'all. She was at a point now where she was already had to continue the process. So even though she probably would wanted to be done with him because the ID. The show was already booked. She wasn't for the stop anything. She did not like this man, but Abby, I don't think she likes him at all. So I just, I don't know. Mm -hmm. That's what they're gonna be enough. She was nitpicking so, from mm -hmm. the. She was nitpicking from the beginning because here's the thing. I have, you know, a number at least twice in my life have have waited a long period of time to see somebody, and when you first see them. You are excited to see them. You are not nitpicking the way they walked up to you, the way they stand. The, I mean, she was nitpicking out the gate. So it was already like everybody else was like, oh, you look like your pictures. Even though the one dude was mad about, and I think her body looked the same, but whatever. That was his perception. He need glasses. But anyways, you know, everybody else we'll was like, oh, I mm -hmm. like, they look like their pictures. They, we're going to get to that because I got shit to say about him. But I got you know, shit to I say like too. Every, I got some receipts in as well. Like, oh, we look so nice. Oh, we we matching outfits and didn't even plan it. You know all this other stuff, and she was just like, "I don't like the way he's staying." Are we in a romance now? It was the now earrings, right? Huh? It was the Michael Jordan earrings in both ears. I can't. <laughs> I ain't even paying attention to that. That's how that's uh, uh, interested I was because she was nitpicking the <laughs> hell out of that. <laughs> She was all right. Yeah, I want to go ahead and go to the uh, with it's um, Sienna and Brandon who would get them together for um, 10 months. And she said part of the problem they were having that he had small children, you know, that's why it was hard for them to meet up. They were mm -hmm. a very sexy couple. Their first date was the cooking date, uh, but her she cute. kept on 
she she kept saying the whole time she can't see love. I really taking her as very genuine because she's not trying to see, oh, I'm in love, I'm happy. She's taking it as in, I don't know. I'm just taking it, just following the process. So what's your, what's your, uh, Lee, what's your, uh with Dina and Lee, what would y'all think about her? I thought she's very pretty. I love her hair too. Cute. I thought Lots it was a cute thing, but I think she's under the impression of it's not going to be like love at first sight. I think she wants to genuinely, because two things can be mm, true at the same I agree. time. You can okay, you can be on the phone with a person and oh, the conversation and the chemistry is great. And then when you meet in person, they're not as funny or they're mm -hmm. they're not as charming or witty or whatever. Come so on I really now. think that she's like, okay, yeah, okay, he looks like his pictures, you know, he's he's you know the guy that he said he was, but let me get to know it's almost like I'm gonna start from day one knowing you in person. Um, right, right. What what you think, Lee? What's that noise? What you think, Lee? Uh, uh, okay, that makes yeah. Um, the the <laughs> sorry, the young kids. Uh, I don't. Is he like a full time dad? I guess there's more questions because is he a full time dad mm. or because th that's the only way that I would be able to like is he a full time single dad? Because that would be the only logic reason that I I mean I come up with a couple more but the one that I'm thinking of right now is why they couldn't see each other because he's a full time um he's a full time single baby, dad. You... but or and because he got young kids he's still fucking his baby mama I'm willing to bet oh lord <laughs> oh no oh no what Jesus I'm help willing, Jesus I'm help so uh, listen I don't date oh I don't date God. men who, who got kids seven and younger I don't date men I don't date men who got kids seven and younger. Why? Because they're gonna they still trying to spend a block with their baby mama. Oh my I mean, God. You know, Lord, you have a point. Tell me I'm lying. So my son's father and I Thanks. never tried that. Boys 27. When we were done, we were done. But I can't always assume that's you got a point. You can't always assume that's the case. Cause I go with my foolish mm -hmm. self thinking it's the case and it don't be the mm -hmm. case. And I'd be like, but I saw it. You hated. I saw you hated her. I saw you hated Erica Scrappy. Exactly. Now, and now you over here looking stupid. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't fuck with her. She just, she just, no, nah, uh, meanwhile, y'all over here playing now. Absolutely the fuck not. Now, Mama, but Mama D. Mama D. Every, Mama. every time he talks to you, he can't stand her. Oh, meanwhile, he just texting her what he wanted for dinner. So, absolutely the fuck right. not. Oh no! Uh, we we going down a rabbit hole. We, we going to do it. We okay. Uh, okay. Wait, yes. Wait, we Let's go bring Just a thirty. I know we not going down a rabbit hole. Wait, wait, I was angry. Thirty seconds. Frontier wait a minute, because I'm so upset. Because <laughs> Sephora sent me this big. I ordered this. Look at this motherfucking box that they put this in. Oh, there's going to be some perks. Oh my god. <laughs> some perks. What in the? What in the too much paper are we using? Dot com. That's a whole five. We wonder why that goes on, but that's, that's a whole nother story. Lord have mercy, Jesus. Okay. So anyways, I need. Uh, I, I just need a little bit more clarification on what you know is. Well, hopefully, single, yeah, that's a good question. Single good father, question. you know, and right. is, is, to why he couldn't, um, you know, they couldn't meet up or you know whatever the destination. He listen, I'm about to. Drop you off at your grandma my house for the weekend. I got some shit to do. Like I'm trying to understand Where's the that, Dina? entire. Trying to get you a step mama, kid. Yeah, I'm, it's, I'm it's, working it's, on it's trying just, to get it you a step mama. Like kids are being utilized as the reason why people not seeing each other. That's what I'm saying. That was exactly. that I heard on the show. But let so, me tell you, exactly. Who, who people are time for what they want. Why you on the show? Oh, who who watches? You got time. You got time. You got to get rid of them kids. You go on TV. But you couldn't you get away you know from your kids for a private weekend. Oh, Lord, that's that's, that's it. That's it right there. Well, that's no, the word. That's, that's the all word. I'm saying. It is. Right. That don't make sense to me. That's why. The people the man, it it worse when he's a single father. The TV people are paying for this. Mm -mm. They are. Even so still, just is like, just like, for the babysitter? Yeah. Is they paying? Hold that's on. what I'm saying. Hold on, hold on. Let's do one more time. out for the babysitter. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's what I'm no, trying to get about to. the nanny. <laughs> <laughs> not are you paying for are, the baby. Are the kids the in the house next door? 
are they are they having daycare next door? Nah, All these people that's not Keisha and them. Hold on, wait, not Keisha and Pookie and them. <laughs> don't mind right. somebody, Jesus. Y'all got baby not kids baby. next door. What's what's popping? <laughs> we don't die. We. Multiply. Okay, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Okay, I'm done. Y'all know I'm gonna fucking start as a rap. So let, let let me go. I really want to get to. Say, I think it's Sandia and Chris. To me, when they first, when I first mm. saw it, I'm just gonna give my first impression. Hold up, I'm gonna mm. give my first impression. I was like, oh my god, they're matching. They're Woo. so cute. You know, like everything was everything with the little the dinner and the helicopter, whatever, whatever. Now I know we're gonna get into how it is so odd how everything is so beautiful in this day, and then when you get to the house and y'all playing dominoes and chilling and all the things you told this girl to get out of the kitchen. It's Baby, not it's what it could not be me. After. It could not be me. That was after. I'm saying, hold on, wait, one attack. I know everybody got something to say. I'm just saying it could not be me. Mm. Now, what'd you say, Dina? Go ahead, Dina. Okay, Dina. first of all, he told her to get out the kitchen after he told all the dudes that he's single and they're not exclusive in how he get bitches. I was like, no, oh, oh, my oh my God, I cannot. He said, oh. I said, I talked to a lot of girls, a lot of girls. He said, I would did have spent a whole lot of time, some hours with her, and then I'm done with her. I just leave her. I'm I like, what? Times I sleep with him, and then I, I'm two words. I'm gone. Uh uh. I no, didn't sir. understand any of that. Why she was just sitting there? She was uncomfortable, but you said nothing, ma'am. Of what happens when you sit there to put, telling men all the things you like, they will show up and do all of those things. Come on they, now, a narcissist, and then they will mm -hmm. divest. But let me say this when because he, he actually showed her who he actually was. Mm -hmm. Now the, the real the real thing is uh what are you gonna do now? Because he literally told you who he was in front of other people. That's all I'm saying. Right. Uh and he could have uh, been uh, propagating uh, in front in front of the fellas uh, trying to, you know, ego trip and all that. But at the same it, time, it, that's the ridiculous. That's real, his, mouth, no. his disrespectful no as all get out. No and I just need him to go get whore stamped on his forehead so the other women oh, that no. encounter him can be warned. He needs a well, warrant. My pearls. The he, all my the way is. he was talking, he is a walking whore and a potential Oh, oh no. Oh, my God. God. Well, the, the crazy thing about that is Woo! you can Jesus hell you can, you can stamp him with the word whore and somebody's still gonna fuck. Yeah, because yeah, I mean they can't but you signed up. Y'all gonna give me a yellow on my dog on channel. Uh, uh, you know what you signed up for. Uh, though. Uh, hold on, hold, because he's the hold, type hold, of hold, hold on, uh <laughs> did you mute her? I can't go. I, no, I did not. Uh did, I, no, Dina and, and Lee are choosing the same spirit today. So hold on right quick. Uh, uh, Erica, I are you still there? Hold on, Erica, are you still there? I want to make sure. It's... Not even. He breezy and checked out the exit of the van. <laughs> Erica, Erica. Okay, my thing is, from what I recall of the episode, he told her, I'm going to say something that's going to offend you. Before they even went on a date, like remember when they did the telephone call? So she already, she was oh, like, yeah, "Oh, did. be nice." So he already told you he was an a hole. So you already knew what you were getting, mm -hmm. and you met him three months ago. So that goes back to like, why are you even on the show? You still should be texting, mm -hmm. dude. Like you don't know him right. anyway. But now you do. You know what I'm saying? But he told you, "Oh, I'm gonna say something that's gonna offend you." What? You know what? <laughs> so look, I don't. What I don't like is self-proclaimed assholes because somebody. Oh Jesus, be offense. I want to see. Gonna I she, she I, thought I she was having big fun. That, that's she what, thought she was having a big fun. She thought she was having a big fun in Baltimore. I was, uh, listen, I want to see the hoes that he get because there's some hoes that just be like, just let him get away with everything and, and hype him up. But if he fucking with a bad bitch, she ain't going to let that shit slide. I need to see the hoes that he getting for him to pr be a self-proclaimed oh asshole. Woo. Woo. I, need to, I need to see. Okay, um, the views and opinions expressed on this panel are those of this panel. And are for entertainment purposes only. Do not, and I repeat, do not try this at home. And don't whine in the comments when you don't like it. We don't care. Thank like you. Who, like who yeah, raised? Yeah, yeah. Like who raised you to like? Oh, I'm gonna say something to offend you. You want to know how quick I would have got up? I didn't delete people for less. Oh, you gonna say oh, something no, to offend me? Delete okay, and block and, and let me and repeat. Take my, my block list. Mm -hmm. Three, three, mm. from, from here to Baltimore. 
So I want to say something to offend people. So that means that you're purposely doing stuff on purpose to say to offend people. Jesus, hell. Because who walks up to somebody say on the first time meeting them, I'm going to say something to offend you? That's fucking gas. No. He wasn't even trying to be offensive. What he was doing was peacocking in front of his homies. These are not his friends. The dude Listen, was looking at him don't, don't get fucked up in front of wow. your little friends. Mm -hmm. Ain't that one? Hey, 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 with, with all the violence and things, what, what's going on? It's just like, just, just, it's genetic. Like, that was, you know, you, that was, that's corny man it behavior. It is, it is. That's corny, that, that's corny, <laughs> that's corny, that, that's corny man behavior. Cornball, that's his name for the rest of the season. Yeah, but he's trying otherwise. to impress the dudes. Oh, no. A lot of the dudes are there serious about the women that they're there he, with. He seems right? like the so, type of. He, and like, you see, he was the only one saying something goody. He was the only one barking. He was the only one barking. Everybody was looking like, uh. Mm -hmm. Let me. He seems like. Somebody was like, oh, dude. your girl, your girl, air hustling. Um, Continue what you were saying. They was egging him on. Go ahead, player. Look. So. Right. He. He seems like the type that to cancel ridiculous. a date because he want to hang with his niggas. That's corny. He's corny. It, that did. That did. That did. Mm -hmm. You don't want, want me, bro. You want. You don't want oh, me. Oh, you want. You Jesus. want them. If I'm right, that's you team. You, 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 you team. You team. You team. Uh, team Sandia. <laughs> Everybody. I mean, all, I, all I have to say is. <laughs> so he should have known. She should have known, especially with the comment. I might say something. I think he's using this as a platform to be oh, funny. He goes, maybe he think he about to yeah. get a spin yeah. off. I don't know. You know, he Not just came on there trying to to do a little bit too much. I know people feelings out. Jesus in him. the process. But at the second, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. The second I heard him say. We are not boyfriend and girlfriend. We are not exclusive. And I'll be getting all these women and I, I, I lay on the charm and then I'm out. That's exactly what you plan on doing to me. You're not changing your spots overnight. And oh, sorry, y'all. Oh, oh, not, not the um, dog. Lady, the dog agreeing. <laughs> <listen, listen laughs> uh, right. Yeah, the dog said that's right. That's right. He's a dog. dog. That's, that's my, my homie. homie. Yeah, I know oh, him. Okay. Uh, but check this out. I'm gonna give y'all a life be lesson. My homie. I'm gonna be give y'all a life lesson that I learned. So y'all don't have to learn it. The worst thing that oh, you can God. ever do is try to love the hoe out of a person. So don't do it. Jesus. It is highly not recommended. Uh, mm -hmm. Negative. Jesus, well, somebody did something somewhere we down give, the line. We, somebody we give it a whole a dream today. A housewife. Mm. Oh Lord! <laughs> Somebody giving a hoe a dream. Y'all gonna give me a yellow? Jesus, hell. He he could be a he could be a whole. <laughs> this 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 is a whole aspiration of a whole theory that we are literally going off. Oh my God! Help. Right. But I'm just, well, what we're we invited to um we is. review panel. I'm if you are new to, to the panel, the you know, it is like this all the time. <laughs> I'm just trying to tell the good people the lesson that I learned that they don't have to go through the motions and learn. You cannot love the hoe out of somebody. And sometimes you just got to let a hoe be a hoe and keep it moving. Wow. That's the post. Oh, and don't All right, we're going to move on to... We're going to move on. We're going to move on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Did she find the flights? Hold on. Uh, yes, yeah, $158. Come on, 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 preacher Evan. Come on. I'm just saying, if it had the Scorpio in me, if I had ear hustled and heard the nigga that I came all the way here to see, we not together, we not boyfriend and girlfriend, I'm not exclusive, I get bitches. I this is what I, I do. Like and no. then you saw me ear hustling and you told me to leave. I would have been like, bet. And I would have walked up the stairs, packed all of my shit, and I would have hit the Come door. On, poetic, <laughs> Evie. You ain't got to tell me twice you don't want me. That, that's okay. Bet, bet money, mm -hmm. my nigga. And then it's like I never met you. It'd be like Come on, you ain't got to hit me once. But you got to hit me once, once Ike. Ike. You got to hit me but once, once Ike. Ike. Mm -mm. Who finna play with you? You got to go stand there and let that man pound on you. That's my favorite line. She like, said, "You gotta hit me. You ain't gotta hit me once, right? Like, you saw me. You saw me over there, and you said all of that shit. 
You said all that. Eat the cake. The lack of shame. It's the lack of shame he had. It was the lack of shame having to her. He didn't care. God help. What's his name? Chris. Yeah, got to worry about me. Okay. Yeah, Chris. Cornball Chris. Cornball Chris is he want to hype? He want to hype people up? The you just he gave he gave he gave her he gave her a dream and a nightmare all on the same day. I'm like, damn. Okay, Meek Mills. He showed her what I want to know is he a Gemini because that would make it make sense. It gives cancer. Oh Lord, have mercy. I can't. Uh, ma'am. Oh, hold up! I'm a cancer, and uh, no, ma'am, I don't. I'm not going to sanction that at all. Should that? Mm -mm. No, so we're I going said to Gemini. I said if he's okay. a Gemini, I... that would make sense. I see a cancer. It's giving cancer behavior. It's giving not. So we're going to move on yes. to Diamond and men. Aaron. Cancer me. Cancer me. I have with Diamond. I, I, have to, I have to defend cancer because I don't. I, mm. No, well, you don't. We talk. No, about you cancer. don't. You know. It, listen, I feel like I'm you a cancer man. It's giving cancer man. We talking about cancer. I have an issue with um Diamond out the gate. Diamond is the the BBW, right? Thank you, Goody. Oh, yes. Uh, yeah. mm -hmm. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. beautiful. She walked into that house talking about how she not a girl's girl. Oh, yeah, that was a big problem. And I do not, she did but say that. Then she proceeded. She did say that. Get in each of the girls business as if she was a girl's girl. I got a problem with it. I agree. As I agree with that. Not, even this panel that we doing, you got to be a girl's girl to deal with some of the things we deal with together. So mm -hmm. I, it, mm -hmm. I got a problem with you, man. I oh, Jesus, yes, you do. He got a problem. Yeah. You're now, not walking into the house. Was it? Was what? Hold on. Was, was, but was she just talking about? Was, I'm sorry. Was she just? Was she just meaning the fact of staying with, like, in the bedroom with them, not necessarily? I'm not the a commodity girl. of being friendship. I'm, I'm just asking. Yeah, she but it don't matter because she, because she's she, but most when she was talking about it about staying in the room yeah, with but them. that don't matter. You know what he gave? Y'all know that TikTok story about the girl who was talking about oh, the the broke girl that went to Cabo, the one that was giving the story. That's what mm -hmm. that what energy she gave. What's her name? Akila Talia. Energy that she gave. She walked in the house. But as a as a, a Goody know what I'm talking about. The Big Bad Club. I would just like to say she is not a clear representation of us. Because oh. we, not all of us are like that. For her to get her, first of all, I'm angry because you was on FaceTime with this nigga with half of your wig back here. In the yep. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? You're on national TV, bitch. What is happening? Why would you do that? I didn't understand that. I don't understand. Why Why would you, did you not know that My your wig hurt. Had all the way back off your cap? You couldn't see yourself? I'm, I'm gone. And you know you was recording for television. I'm clicking out of this chat. I'm, at least Lee is exiting the Secondly, chat. For you to take your big I'm back clicking self, off. Up the stairs and see that all the women in one room and all the men are in one room. And you talk about, oh, well, I'm not sleeping in here with y'all because I don't get along with women because women are catty. And you Nobody the cattiest person. Said the cattiest of them all. So you, go ahead. So you it's, time, it's, it's time for a break. You are on the inside. Oh, not to blow the smoke. You projected that what you are onto these women that you haven't met and haven't given you any of that. I don't understand if they, you came in and they was giving you eyes or, or treating you some type of way. Them women were welcoming and loving to you when you got there. So for you to get your nasty attitude, have ass self up here and be like, oh, the women are scat the women are catty and I don't like them. And da -da 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 -da. So you don't like, so you don't like yourself, is what you're saying. And and as an elder in the house, she's an elder in that house too. She she an older elder, than not right. she's, she's older than she's forty four. <laughs> she's forty four, and the man is fifty one. Not the Janelle is giving the ages, him. I was like, what you mean, sir? And if How we want to talk about their date, we can talk about date. the nigga she's there to see. Why is you here to see a nigga who was finna get? Engaged to another bitch. Like, I don't, what? Why was his date so lackluster? Let me just please. This is preach on it. Preach on it. Ghetto. Th th that's one word. That, that, Why the first episode, is it so ghetto. rough today? Ghetto. Ghetto. Because <laughs> this, this message, why?
there's no way in hell that I'm finna claim you and you was about to marry, posted the ring on Facebook like we not friends, that you about to marry somebody else only because you thought we was never going to see each other. Dude, planes, trains, automobiles, mega bus, great leadership, spirit, frontier. You know what? You better better go down to the truck stop and hitchhike. Because it was, it had been some years into the re- to the relationship, into their interactions, and they had never met in Paper person. Doll. Now, sir, let, let me explain just one fact that us women, most of us, hopefully, you know, if he wanted to, he, he would. would. So the fact that your ass ain't yes. got on nothing to go see about her. You could afford an engagement ring, but not a plane ticket. That part was confusing too. Was that he had to a, say that exact line, and and it had to be. It, but did he? But I hold on. When did he, he say when he bought the ring? Yeah, he he brought the ring. Did he say he, when he got the ring? No, but, but no, he but he probably had that ring at Walmart. He could not. That was just about to say one of his dollars, sir. If you got the money for a ring. And you supposed to be all this, and you ready to be a protector, provider, and some woman's husband, and you have the resources to facilitate. Not that, a hitchhike. You will have hitchhike. the resources to get your ass. Not the Flintstones. Use your feet. The Flintstones. <laughs> use your feet. <laughs> listen, listen. Look, you better go down to that truck stop. You scared of flying or getting on the train, and you won't be fly me out. Listen, be, because why you not fly me out, sir? If I want okay. you want, but that could go for all of them. That that's the case. Speak because that goes for all of them. We didn't all we didn't, I, from, I, from the we didn't, all, we didn't all been flewed out or drove out or whatever out on this panel. I can I can say. Sure. But I had a, and and Fenty again flewed and, out overseas, okay. right over here. That's how I got okay. my first hey, passport. I, I I had a nigga say, "What city you in? Oh you oh you in Atlanta? Bet you, you be at Hart, be at Hartfield on Friday. You're coming up here to see me." Exactly. So if it, oh, trust his wagon to pull. If he wants to, if he if he wants to, he'll do it. He there, bells on. And he, yeah. he at the airport he waiting. Feels on like me. it's required. He'll do it because surely the woman who he brought the engagement ring let him know that she was on a certain kind of time. So he ran himself down mm-hmm. to the Walmart and got that engagement Not the ring. World. The 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 for what paying for Not the Walmart? Oh my god! So you know, because you know that she. Cause you know, you know that she was involved with that. I said, but you know she was involved with that, the the whoever that girl or whatever it was, because he said he felt like it wasn't gonna happen. He felt like he wasn't gonna happen, so he gave up, did the ring thing. It's just so, so much more that I feel like we're missing in all the stories, just like what Lee was talking about. Hold on, yeah, hold on, yeah, hold on. Yeah, yeah, look, look, Erica has not had Erica, jump in, mama, jump in. Go ahead, tag you. What I want to say is, I think with all of these, the reason why you don't see the person is because they're not your main person. So he didn't fly her out because the person he's engaged to was number one. And then once they broke up, he got back with her. And that, I mean, to me, most of the people who didn't, like the kids are probably just excuses. They probably have real relationships with people in their town. And then, mm. you know, but they can still text Hometown, girl. or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> that's how people thing. move. You so have. once that person at home breaks up with them or guesses their phone or whatever, then now it's a thing. But that person, if he was close enough to that person mm. to propose, whether he got the ring at Walmart or not, he's already been seeing that person. They, so they, she they, was they, a number they, two. They, and just exactly. didn't that know was a, that it was a previous time. relationship, apparently. You know what I'm that saying? Was a yeah, relationship. So, here's my thing clearly, none of you. I think if they were really serious, we would have heard about attempts being made. But besides that one couple where the man lost his ID on his way to see her, that is the only time anyone spoke of an attempt being made for them to actually get. Into the same vicinity with mm-hmm. each other. Everybody mm-hmm. else is talking about, oh, we've been yes. FaceTime yes. and texting and da 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 for all of these years. I ain't heard nobody say, well, one time we tried to get together and it was.
something and happened. the people oh, and the people that live right, in LA right, right. and we just couldn't make it work. All I, that, I only heard that from one couple one time. True. Yeah, very like, true. In the, so, and the people thinking any of you niggas seriously, because clearly y'all not serious about it. Exactly. And as a strong watcher of catfish. I got on the plane and came to Texas. Oh, as a strong watcher of catfish, the only things that keep you from the person are prison and another person. <laughs> oh, wow, ain't damn. stopping you. So, your, we, your, we, your we, whatever ain't stopping two, you. Two, two people we've already established. <laughs> We've already established that two. We've already established that two people have already mentioned that they're children. So I do feel like there's a lot of excuses. Of course, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Those are excuses. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think. I think those are excuses because to me, it's like it'd be one thing to say for the people who you know, like maybe anybody less than a year. Yeah, my daughter had had to go to the hospital, so I can't come this weekend. But over 12 years, your kids can come up every single time. I'm not saying you spin in the block, but you don't want to come. You know what I'm my, saying? Like to me, I think kids are a good I mean, excuse I, 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 but, you can't I, I, challenge it. Okay, uh, Lee, hold on, Mama. Go ahead. I, I know Lee wants to say, I just want to say, I think with Diamond, I think, I was going to say, I think with Diamond and Aaron is more to the story. Uh, go ahead, Lee. Lee. Huh? <laughs> So go ahead, Mama. Uh, <clears throat> Erica's just she just said what I was getting 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 ready to say about the kids um always being an excuse. They, I'm not trying to be funny, but they ain't got y'all ain't got no uh, where's y'all's village at? Y'all ain't got no aunties, no cousins, no uh, hey, nothing. You ain't so you just out here just a single single parent. It's hard out here for a pimp, and, and you ain't got nobody to watch your kids. Nobody. Hang on, Lee, right quick. The, the ranting show, I think you've said this before, and, you know, at the end of the day, it's a panel, and we're having a discussion. Um, there are going to be times we may talk over each other. I moderate <laughs> the best of my ability, but these people are grown, and we're having a, a heated discussion. And honestly, we're having a great discussion. You seem to say this a lot. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go be I'm gonna be super chill here, but um, it is what it is, ma'am. Go ahead. Uh, continue, Lee. Yeah, just, so that's, know, that, I don't, I don't understand like i and i don't and don't and don't bring me don't bring me a problem without a solution i can't oh I, you know what baby i ain't gonna be able to come to see you this weekend but um next weekend or two weeks from now i'm gonna be able to i'm gonna be able to pull up on you don't come with me, don't come to me with a problem without no solution mm -hmm. okay but like i said i do think it's more to well i think there's more to a story to all the couples we're only seeing business pieces i think erica and i even with lee pulling that earlier about the kid situation, uh, is he a single dad? I think there's just more that we need to know. Um, I do want to go ahead and get into, let's see, Greg and Millie. Three years. They both live in Los Angeles. Uh, girl, I'm trying to get... Uh, I've been trying to... Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Greg and Millie, three years. They both live in L.A. Uh, she's into birds, and that's when they went on the boat ride. Let's go ahead and crack, because I want to get into the Dominique and Alexis. Kind of get, let's get through this kind of quick. So go ahead, so, Lee. What are you saying about them? Let me tell she you something. Birds. As some, as somebody, if she into birds and you live in fucking LA. That's she like she that's the, the penguins and birds. He brought her the that's penguin cool. and all that. So anyway, he won the boat ride. LA, yes, LA is LA is B, LA is actually small. It's just spaced the fuck out, and, and, and ain't no way that you had then lived in LA for three three and y'all been dating for three to five years because we didn't really get that information correct or uh, the accuracy of that, but. The one on one ain't that fucked up for you not to be able to hop on, hop on and, and and figure it out. Me in the middle, S Santa Monica, West Hollywood, Woodland Hills, Calabasas, Downey County. I done named five different cities in 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 L.A. that y'all could have met in, and you got to have a car out there. So I need to understand why y'all ain't met. Cause mm -hmm. L.A. ain't that it ain't it ain't enough traffic in L.A. for y'all couldn't have met after three years. I'm gonna give y'all the benefit of the doubt and say three. It said they said three years. Three years they lived there. They uh, they know whatever they've been doing in three years. One hundred and one, the four hundred and five. Hell, uh, Santa Monica Boulevard, because that stretch a long way too. I don't understand. We don't either. And and they in L. A. for the show. <laughs> I don't. So uh -uh. They are filming in Santa Monica. <laughs> As a matter of fact, they are filming in Santa Monica. 
I cannot. I cannot. Are you serious? Because the house is in Calabasas. Oh my God. I looked at, okay, hold on. I'm sorry. I looked at it My God today. My Abbey voice. When they went on, when they went on that cooking date and, and they went to I'm whatever so the name confused. of that cooking school was, I Googled it and it's in Santa Monica. So y'all filming in the Santa Monica area. What? And y'all wow. you, and you can, so roll so down the street. Y'all roll down the street for the show, but y'all couldn't CPH. roll down the street to meet each other in three years. So the cooking place is off the of CTA. So um uh, Y'all took CPH to get to this cooking place, but y'all couldn't take it to meet each other. Listen, I'm you in couldn't New get an Uber, daughter. You couldn't get a he couldn't get you an Uber to bring you to where he is. At? I'm in New York. We outside. I'm outside. Pull up. Pull up on me. I'm outside. Pull up on where me. You be up. Where you Not want pull me? Up. <laughs> pull up. Pull up on me. me pull up Girl, on. Y'all be outside, but still, I listen. I can, I don't I understand can how you be out. Go. How you can be out. Outside and then not be outside and run into this nigga. Not they live thirty minutes from it. No, Shut they up. do not. No. No. no, they do not. No, they do not. No, they do not. In this, Come on. Okay, so I was like, I wasn't gonna say because I don't want nobody talking saying that I didn't jump on these people in the confessional or at the preview. They or it's too late before the show started. He said we live thirty minutes from each other, in, or thirty to forty-five minutes from each other, and we ain't never seen each other. How? How? Oh, how? Uh, because that is so crazy. I feel like Even at the corner store, as as somebody that live in LA, there's not a lot of places that black people go to, into to somebody. begin with. We go to the same place. I don't get that. You because even in like a certain area, you run into people like that. You know, I'm not saying like in in, in that time frame. That's when hard for me to believe that. Thank you. I'm, I'm just saying Thank it's you. hard to believe that if you run the same circles, that really narrows the the narrows it down that you're gonna really run into each other. You want to that know doesn't make any sense circle? to me. That you have a seat at the grocery store or something. Black and education. As soon so, as you are black and educated, that circle so small you done seen each other. The there it is. Let know me tell you something. I went to one they because in LA they have this event that it's every month. It's called uh black different on events the block. and stuff like that. Too, yeah. It's black on the block. I went to one black on the block event and it was a whole bunch of black people. Two days later, I seen three people that I met at the black on the block event at a pool party. So I know that there's no way that wow. you cannot not run into this nigga. It makes no fucking That's sense. Interesting. I would that just like to say That's that I live in a big, small city. Charlotte is huge, but it also can be very small. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I have never seen any of those people from the pods in real and around the city. Again, it just it depends on your social circle and who you running with there it could absolutely be a possibility that them two could be living in the same city and not just not be in the same social circle so they never actually met then that, that could happen. actually happen however comma oh come on somebody you can't <laughs> i feel like we're being finessed no, man, in pause. this particular situation because i feel mm. like maybe they knew of each other and they would chat occasionally on social media, knowing and they were no friends, I believe. But it ain't never been no serious, oh, we try to be in a relationship, but I we ain't never seen each other in three years. Right, right. So what Goody just, just said. Mm, it interesting. Make, it doesn't make sense. It so Goody just said. Sense. I feel like we get finessed. Hold on, hold on, mama. I feel like they actors who, uh -huh. they live in LA and they kind of knew each other through social media and stuff and they saw this and auditioned and got it they and now out. they put 10 on 20 on what they got going on the ghetto, not the ghetto that's not the ghetto not, stuff them all because not script and not just, act like on those goody just goody just the said shit with the uh the getting people to come on shows Goody just said that they they know each other, they have mutual friends, which brings me to my next thing. You or what I just said, you can't you can't know each other through mutual friends, and y'all ain't never been to a mutual friend outing. It makes no sense. I told you what it was. Then I digress. Well, because it is LA, that's this is why this is partly why when uh, people was talking about ready to love in LA, why they said that they want to do it because they feel like it was like a certain whatever, fake or whatever. 
this is this is this is very very interesting. Yeah. And them doing what it is. is. It is what it is. Man. They make it graphically you know, on the yep. show. They make this shit up. They 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 bolster. They because they had to uh, they had to apply for this show as a couple. Oh, I live here and she he lives here. We right, right. Mm-hmm. Bop, bop, bop. They that's what they gave the producers. When they went into audition, or when they went to apply to be on this show, they got on this show because they want people to see them, and they very much look at me, look at me. Now it's a show. Manufactured love story that mm-hmm. we've been in the same city, yes, for three and we want to be together, but we never met up in real life. I mean, I do also say this is an opportunity that Olive could use. Like, if I didn't want to get a ticket, da da da, I can utilize the show. To they're gonna pay for all this stuff. I mean, that's also a fact that I thought about too. But we're gonna get into the uh things of the things with Dominique and uh Alexis. That's a whole situation as itself. Which uh, one's is that? Dominique and Alexis is the one Lex uh, <clears throat> she's with us from from Texas. Now we're facing dogs. And that's the one with <laughs> that's the one with yeah, the hoochie. Thank you, buddy. The hoochie, the hoochie. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the, the the she was talking about he was talking about her body and all the stuff like that whatever so this is what I'm gonna say when he first saw her because I broke this down I also of course you already know I've been I got some information behind the scenes so if you watch the the scene where he's talking about her but then when you watch the scene where he sees her in person it's two different things you acting funny because you want a confession talking about you don't like a body and a body look different and the picture look different whatever whatever but that's not how you was moving when you was on that floor, you on that mat, and how you was in her face and da 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 da. So to me, I feel like there was some forgets going on because the kids the understand the confessions take different times. Mind you, he got pissed off at the end, talking all that crap because the hoochie daddy shorts. So I'm just saying, I want, I'm, you know, I'm gonna break it all down too because I know, you know, I know the T. And so to me, for him talking about her body like that and everything else, but you really liked her, you just pissed off. So I know everybody got something to say. Whenever y'all want to jump in, it don't matter because I got some stuff I want to I want to add to that as well. Uh, okay, what, uh, go ahead, Abby. Uh, <clears throat> okay, so here's the thing. Here's here's my thing. You two meathead motherfuckers got together Ooh. and had a oh, fucking yeah. conversation of how both of you are motherfucking territorial and jealous. And don't breathe in another bitch's direction. And you don't be looking at no other niggas. And so then you got your big me head ass over there in that kitchen and started talking about this nigga in these coochie daddy shorts. So when your nigga who told you he don't play games like that, don't breathe at another nigga after you just told him you the exact same way. For you to act dumbfounded like you don't know what you did and you wouldn't have the exact same reaction if that nigga said something about one of these other broads is Crazy work. That's crazy work. <clears throat> you don't see that y'all both the same fucking words. Oh. So what I was talking about, I know what you're saying, Abby. What I was talking about was him getting mad about that. How getting mad about that, going into confessional and talking about how he didn't like her body. Under the comments that's actually on public on their own network, or whatever, the own whatever, Instagram or whatever. She puts on in there, not neat body shaming me, neat Dominique, because he was mad at the time. <clears throat> and I went back over there. He did type under there. And he said, I take it back, boo, you fine, because he was mad about the hoochie daddy shorts. Now, I'm not I'm not disputing what no. you're saying. Abby. No, he's, I'm saying that's what happened. That's what happened. I'm not saying what you're saying is wrong. I'm just telling you that's some context. That's why he oh, said it when he said the confession about her body. That's that's neither here nor there. So I you mad about? So I, I don't care because clearly he likes I'm, her body because he was damn near on top of her when they were trying to do the damn yoga. Irrelevant that he got on, he got in his his ass on his show. Not irrelevant. Professional six months later about so you, some other shit and then decided yes, to say something yes, crazy uh, about her yes, body. Uh, so yes, Lee, yeah. let me make right. sure I got this correct. I, so you mad because somebody con uh some somebody didn't like the outfit that you had on and you went after her physical body yes. 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 In, instead of that's cornball mm-hmm. behavior. Mm-hmm. Well, we that, that's that. all I was saying. 
Childish, that's corn and bobby. immature. <laughs> that that because not you, not you talking about my the way that my body looked when I commented on your hoochie daddy shorts. You apparently thought no, that no, you no, no. Ate not his, not, not, not his shorts. But, no, that's mm. not what happened. He, she commented on somebody else's hoochie daddy shorts, and he felt like that was flirting. I don't know how you could see that as flirting when it's not. There are no single people in the house. Everybody's coupled up. So she let, would have let, to let Cornball Chris tell it he's single. <laughs> well, first of all, she was actually dragging him. If you want to look at it like that, when talking about the hoochie, the hoochie daddy shorts, it wasn't like she wasn't was dragging real. him. We're not even going to try. They, uh, with, like what what you different. mean? Look, if you're going to try to say it's a flirt, that, that, that was a heavy flirt. I didn't look at that flirt to me. To me, it wasn't a flirt at all. First of all, first of all, No, ma'am. Don't do that. If you tell, if this nigga told you, don't even breathe in another nigga's direction after you just told him the same thing, and then you take your airheaded ass into this key <laughs> and decide to comment on this man's body and what he got on. Oh my god! At that point, at that dynamic, after y'all had that conversation and understand it, and that's where we're at with it <laughs> when it comes to people outside of you and me. Then you just violate it. It is what it is. That's the agreement that you have between you and him. That he, because I damn sure know if some broad was standing in some little house booty shorts at the kitchen trying to get her some fucking potato chips to go back and sit down and talk. To her. Sure. And he said, Oh, you got the hoochie mama shorts on. Oh, come on with the cakes out and all that other stuff. You would have bust him upside That's the back of the head. Because why the fuck is you commenting on her body? Same, same. Daughter, you brought that on yourself. Because you and him had and that agreement. Now, okay. he got out of pocket when he put his hands around her. So, 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 me, mama, I'm going to say, I just, okay, first of all, Eric, I can't add you saying the vice is not going to, mama, I can't add you, baby. So, you know, every we've always come to this road where we usually end up disagreeing. It's going to be one of these moments. So, I don't agree with that. Because I feel like that. Well, no, no, I'm sorry. Let me rephrase that. I agree with some of that. Yes, they both were doing a lot. They did have that discussion, and I guess I mean I'm oh I didn't look at her some of the it's a hoochie daddy shorts as like the flirting to me the rapping thing. I could see, see he, he was they was too get too close. The hoochie daddy shorts I thought because it wasn't just her talking about it. So I didn't think that was a big deal. But the hoochie daddy shorts I don't know. Maybe I just don't get it. Okay. It was a conversation between her and him. Everybody was another an, another girl said and something about the hoochie daddy shorts too. Listen, listen, everybody was no, but nobody else was joining in on the hoochie daddy train with her. Everybody was laughing like, <laughs> but nobody was like, oh yeah, hoochie daddy. Two daddy. girls, no, no, no. One, I can't remember who it was. One, the girl started singing it with her hoochie daddy shorts. Yes, yes. It was just Miss Mama's. It was an interaction between oh. him and her in front of everybody. So, but just because it's in front of everybody and it's supposed to be a joke, oh, you got hoochie daddy shorts on. After you, it 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 just goes to show that clearly you don't think what's good for the goose is good for the gander, daughter. Oh, that's what you think. You think that you can tell this nigga if your eye even twitch in another bitch direction, I'm gonna knock your head in between the refrigerator and the wall. But I'm allowed to do and say and giggle in somebody's face and ask them to spit some raps for me and talk about this man and these little shorts and his legs hanging out and pop all of that. I can do all of that and that shouldn't be a problem for you as my man. But if you even breathe in another bitch direction, it's going to be a problem. No, ma'am. That's Abby, not how Abby, I get, I, even with that, with that being said, I do get that. And you you said it was just her. It was not. There was two girls singing with her to my hoochie daddy shorts. It was not two girls. Another one of the girls. So, but okay, I'm, so I get what you're saying. But, no, hold on, hold on, wait, hold on. Let me say this. Let me say this. Abby, hold on, wait. Hey, Abby, hold on, Abby. Let me get this out. Let me get this out. I understand what you're saying about she, because she did act like she's jealous. And they made a point of, they both are possessive. So that I do agree with you about. She shouldn't be doing any kind of contact or talking about saying thing. You call things to happen. But all I'm saying is when they all were talking about it, they all was joining in the girls were. 
So I'm just saying it wasn't just her, but she's the okay. only one that so got me, chewed up for this. it. That's all I'm yeah. saying. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Let me say this in regards to it not just being her. We don't give a fuck that there were other women saying it. Oh, he Lord. had a conversation with her. He don't give a damn if some other broads is calling, singing the Hoochie Daddy song because he ain't got no agreement with them bitches. He don't know oh. them. He had an oh. agreement with her. Huh. And he spoke to her about what she did. We don't give a damn that the other bras was singing. He, that's just a hooch daddy. That's just a hooch daddy. And, but but, but, but at the end of the day, agree or not, agree or not, his behavior, his behavior was trash. His behavior was trash. His behavior was trash. It's about what she did after they had a conversation about them both being territorial. And don't be talking, breathing, looking, blinking, giggling in another bitch's or another nigga's direction. And then she ought to, as soon as they got back in the house, she immediately did what they just said that they not supposed to do between the two of them. And with that being said, just because she said some hoochie daddy shorts and all the things and some rap song a dude said, he had to act a fool and, and put his hands on her. So I, didn't, I, didn't say I know you didn't. I know you didn't. All I'm saying is it let at the end of the day, it led to that. I don't give a care what discussion, sign, treaty, dotted line, and blood. I'm not going to look at Mr. Da Da Da. The whole thing led to that mess that happened. I just think it's all trash, whether she was wrong or not. And I'm not saying you say she's got no, you don't. I'm just saying it's all, it was just ugly to me. The way they ended, I did not like that. And, and it, oh, it was just so ugly. I, I watched it again. I just didn't like the way he acted towards her. Nothing that she did warrants his behavior. Nothing. It just pissed me off watching that because you could be mad or be upset. He could have handled that so differently. I mean, I know she joined into the her behavior wasn't the greatest as well, but I'm just saying it was just it was just awful to watch. So I mean, you know, I know what you I know what you're saying, everybody get it, but it just it just made me just chill watching the way he was grabbing on her like that. I couldn't stand it. Uh, I'm, um, sorry. I'm sorry that that triggered you. No, but it just I just I, mm -mm. I wasn't no, I know what you're saying, Mama. I know what you're you know saying. What I'm saying? I, it takes it's a, it, in that regard. It takes more than that to trigger, because because I've been, I've been, I've been there. I know I, you I, have. I've been, mm -hmm. I'm swinging on that, right? Because, yeah. Bless God for being able to grow and mature. Mm -hmm. However, he shouldn't have put his hands on her. She shouldn't have put her hands on him. Mm -hmm. And once she felt like she needed to put her hands on him. That's my that's my cute lead. That's that, that okay. And now, right. Right. Who the fuck finna where do was shit? security? Where was security? Thank you, Dina. Thank you, Dina. Good question. Very good question, Dina. Because I mean, I'm just saying, you putting basically strangers in the house. You know, even oh. even the, the people that are dating are still relatively strangers because they haven't met in person, and then they have they know nothing of the other. Uh, so what is it? Seven couples. So the one couple knows nothing of the other six couples, basically, you know? So how are you putting uh, 14 people in a house who are basic strangers? This is not the real world, okay? So you, where was security? Because what if the dudes would have gotten? So was some of them, some of them dudes was kind of, you know, big. Like what, and you know, what if the women got into it? Because somebody stole their lashes or something? Like you don't, mm -hmm. you don't know these people. So how is they? they and then, oh, th I'm sorry, because this was a thought on my brain. Speaking of lashes, how you gonna come back down? And 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 you ain't got no razor. Oh, you couldn't have stopped at the CVS on that long ass drive up to CPH to get you some damn razors. You up in the house asking people for extra razors. What the hell? But anyway, oh that's gosh. what I'm saying. These people don't know these people. And where was security? So I want because they ain't got no budget. What you I want? I I, cause I want to I want to hear from Erica and uh, Goody and, and Lee and jump in on this uh this topic is heavy. So what's your what are y'all thoughts? Uh Erica, can you, are you still there, Mama? Erica? Yeah, I'm here. I oh, think. Okay. Uh, okay um, go ahead, Mama. Can you hear me? Yeah, I hear yes. you. Go ahead. You can good? Yeah, we can hear you. Go ahead. Okay, sorry. Um, first first I wanted to say I wasn't sure. Okay, well, a couple things. One, it was like they were play wrestling or whatever at first, like she was laughing and stuff. So I didn't get, I'm not the wrestling chick, so I don't be playing like that. So that was kind of off to me. And then secondly, I felt like 
he said off the top he was going to give it a chance. He wasn't that attracted to her and all that stuff. So I'm like, so now why are you mad? You know what I mean? Like you weren't in the last scene. You're like, oh, her body is not proportion, whatever. Her body didn't match the editing on her photos, apparently. So I'm like, are you doing this because she told you she was jealous? Like, that's how he said it. Like, now she's, you know, she's going to check me. So I'm now I'm going to check her, which seems petty. You know, well, like, I, if you don't I, really hold care. On, hold, hold on, Panna. I'm, gonna ask, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, actually, Lex is in the Instagram chat. And she asked the question. She said, I'm so confused. Why shouldn't I have put my hands on him if he kept coming up to me? He shouldn't have been putting what? his hands on you either, Sugarfoot. Neither keep your hands to yourself. What you mean? Yeah, I don't fight really with men. Like I, I don't understand. I don't understand. Yeah. He should. Sasha defend herself you though. Let's de defend yourself you though. Put your hands on him, daughter. It, extricate yourself from the situation. Leave. Yep. Distance. Distance. Put and distance you between you and him, because if because that's a big nigga. And if you go put your hands, you gonna have to put that nigga down oh. like a dog. If y'all get into a physical <laughs> altercation, because you're not gonna win that fight. See, so, oh so, goodness. so if he's if he's steady, let me ask, let me ask this question to everybody. If he's if if he's coming at you, you're trying to leave out. He's steady coming at you. You had no other choice to do. You have to do something, even just to move yourself away. You got to do something. Are you going to just sit there and get? No, touched you, on? I ain't sitting nowhere. Listen, I'm, I'm just trying to get out of jail. That's I'm it. picking something up. Listen. I, I, I'm five foot three. I'm not fighting no. I don't play fight with men. I I really don't play fight. If I'm fighting, it's a fight. Right, we get, we get, we tussling for real. For oh real. wow, hold on, y'all. She said so. She said I had. A, she said okay, but I felt like I had to protect myself because production never came in to help me. Wow. Then you, you know, know, answer, 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 answer. Where was but, but the way, but the way, I told you, but the way it was edited, it looked like they were laughing and joking and like wrestling in the beginning. So because that's when the other people yeah, were started. like, we didn't know he it started. was okay. He started. It did, but he he pushed her too hard. He was a big man, and David like Abby right? said, if you go back and David watch that right? scene, he kind of pushed her. He pushed her really kind of hard, and she Baby was like, girl, "Why you had to?" Need a message from the elders. The message from the elders is this: Yo, y'all gonna let this dude push on me and hit exactly. on me? Where were the mm. other? I'm not playing mm. with him. Watching that's because that's what everybody on the screen. Good was question, Abby. Like, where were the it other guys then? It looks like they was playing. It, uh, I, I, I can't remember which one yeah, was saying all of that. One of the girls did yeah. say it looks like they were playing, yeah, so I'm not sure different. how serious it was or not. And then it turned serious. Those were her exact words. One of the girls that was commentating on what happened. And the reason why I was able... he. If this is what he does, he knows what he was doing. He was getting in close to you because he was fin to abuse you on the low. So nobody knew what he was so doing. That's, so that's a good question to ask. And also, to the other men that were sitting there, if you're watching this happen, why did no one else jump in to say, hey, man, you're doing too much? He knew nobody what he did was nothing. doing. He knew what he was doing. He made It did look like if they were playing with each other. It did okay. look like they were talking in each other's ear. He know what he doing. He know he this ain't his first rodeo. He know how to run that. That he was getting close to her, like yo, I'm gonna f you up if you keep playing with me. He was close up on her. Anybody looking from a distance who can't hear what he whispering, mm. think that they playing with each other. That's why the move is to wow. get distance and say, yo, this I am not playing with him. I don't play like this. You're getting too aggressive. You got to be very clear. You are getting aggressive. Mm. Is everyone gonna watch this man put his hands on me? So I you said she should have spoke of his hands up. Lady thought, I had a whole old lady thought in the middle of this because somebody said it happened at 2 40 in the morning. I'm like, why was y'all not in the basement? <laughs> <laughs> like, like my mama my said, like, like, my, 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 my mama always <laughs> said, nothing ever happens <laughs> past 2 a.m. You know, they always say that. Bro, nothing good happens past 2 a.m. The only thing that's open is legs and waffle house. That, I'm telling it's, you, it's a Waffle House sound real good, right? I'm well, well, oh my look. gosh! It, oh, oh my that God! Don't, 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 even get her started. don't even get her started. We'll be here 80 hours talking about the Waffle House. You ain't no. never lying. We not. We not. Come on, come on, come on, Dan. No, no, no. 
<laughs> I want that Waffle House where they put the waffle oh, and then they God. put the stuff in the middle and then the waffle. The, 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 the breakfast sandwich. Okay, yes. y'all, y'all do your own uh Waffle House review. Okay, let's Woo! move right along. Oh my God, oh I can't, you child. Mm-mm. But that, but that, I mean, I, I'm <laughs> sharing said anything else in the comments. Wait, okay, wait. okay, hold on, hold on, wait, hold on. She said, she said I was laughing because I didn't know if he was serious or not. So in my we, head, we, we I was didn't so hear confused. anything that you said. And what was going? We didn't hear anything. And then her fight and flight kicked in, and she started swinging on that nigga. That's hold on, what okay. okay. Okay, so I'll, can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Yes. Can you yes. hear me now? Yes. Okay. I was laughing because I didn't know he, if he was serious or not. So in my head, I was so confused and what was going off. Going on, I think she meant. So I was laughing to try to play it off, but then I was like, damn, he is serious. Right. And like I said, her fight or flight kicked in and she started swinging on him. Understandable. <laughs> That's completely understandable. If them other niggas in there was... Watching this happen, go down, and they didn't say, and they nobody intervened, and production clearly wasn't coming in with no cage because they ain't got no security because they ain't had a budget for it. Then okay, but I'm just advice this, from the elders. I mean, it's, it's it's giving very much Alexis and Jonathan. Like you don't want to, you're laughing to go along, but you're putting yourself at risk, oh, and really? that's the problem. It's because when it's because if show, she's with. Oh, okay. Oh, you saw an old girl. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. So to me, like, if she, you know what I mean? Because she should have been uncomfortable from the beginning because it looked crazy. But then I was like, why are they both smiling? So to me, Mm -hmm. you know, I mean, it's an it's an unfortunate thing. I feel like she put, you know, some other things before her own safety. You know what I'm saying? Wow. When you are in situations like this. Run yourself and govern yourself by your own principles. If you don't play fight with somebody, if you don't play dark energy with somebody, I don't play with men standing over me when we talking. I right, don't like what right. you for you want need to step back. Mm-hmm. I don't I don't feel right, I don't, yeah, like I, I don't do you chokes, the, you know what I'm saying? Maybe Ashley. occasionally, oh, wow. occasionally I might do a spank, but you're not going to What is going on? So, wait a minute, what is happening? This whole, wait a minute I'm now, we like, went to a completely different time. Listen, Erica, the choke, what's going on? Every time. Not the choke, the spank, we not, look, no, we not, got, I don't have, this, I'm going to get a yellow on my freaking channel today. <laughs> People shout out to, if I get a, I, Oh, Lord, I'm trying, Jesus, y'all. No, I, I'm trying. I pray before everyone, but just do, sometime it work out, sometime it don't, okay? It's going to be time for the ceremony and close it very soon. All right, so uh, I don't really have anything else. Um, I really don't. I have an event I have to go to here in a little bit. So anybody got any final words about this first premiere episode of Never Ever Met? Yes, daughter, run. Mm-hmm. Run. This okay. Is not... All right. So, so I need everybody to come on down. I'm, I think I'm about to give somebody some free membership real quick before uh, Pastor Abby uh, is going to come through with the final things and things. So we already got to get. We got the. All right. Tina Bree, Kenzie Lorenz, D. Cooper, Cami K, and Shalisha 09. Y'all have gotten uh, free gift memberships. All right, all right, all right. Another thing, da da da. Now I need uh. Not da da da. I was playing the wrong one. Oh, Lord, da da da. I meant to play this one. Come on down. Y'all got your membership. Now I'm from the half past the Ebby. Go ahead, do what she gotta do. So y'all come on down. Cash apps are welcome. Yes, yes. We're about to get ready in the body here. Y'all know we got chicken and catfish in the back after the ceremony is over and the macaroni and cheese thank you very much all right pastor you ready are you ready pastor all right here we go all right, right. if all hearts and minds are clear dear heavenly father if the enemy comes to you as often as we know how just thank you for all that you are and all that you do now jesus you just started this movie already they act now, I, I, just, I just pray you touch everybody that need to keep having common sense and keep their damn hands to themselves. Lord, I know you heard me cuss because you know who I am and you knew I was going to do it anyway. Uh, listen. Amen. In Jesus' name, yes, Lord. Uh, I, I prayed this prayer for myself, so I'm going to pray this prayer for 
every woman on this show, Lord, if they're not meant for them, take them out of their lives. Move them. Huh? What are you doing? If they listen, Lord, if they not if they're not supposed to be there, if you do not want that man for them, remove them from their lives, God. And set them into the right place, order their steps to walk into the destiny with the man that you have for them. And if you do these things, we'll be so careful to give you the glory and honor that you deserve. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Because I can't. Not fighting in the kitchen at 2 a.m. Amen. 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 Pray for patience for Ask the host. The pray, pray for patience for the host because sometimes I love my ladies, but you know, sometimes, sometimes, you know, it is what it is. All right, y'all. With, with that being said, with that, with that, with that, be, with that being said, y'all, the Queen yeah. of Reality TV and all the things and things, y'all, y'all, y'all know what it is. I really don't have to um, say it, but I'm going to say it anyway. Bye. One thing I want you guys to know, and that nothing that will never change about this. I am the queen of reality TV. Don't get it twisted and don't doubt it. It is what it 